Hey, what's going on, guys? The Horror Man back with Hollow Watch Day 24. Can you believe it? Halloween is already one week from today. So, because of that, in this video, I will be featuring a bonus pick. But my first Hollow Watch Day 24 pick is All Hallows Eve. All Hallows Eve is a 2013 horror anthology film that takes place on Halloween night. In this one, a woman named Sarah is babysitting two children, a brother and sister. Because, you know, in movies like this, it's a common thing for parents to leave their kids with babysitters on Halloween. I mean, you guys have noticed that too, right? Anyway, upon returning home with their bags of candy, Sarah finds an unmarked VHS tape in one of the bags. After some persuading from the children, she decides to play the tape. It is on this tape we are tricked and treated to two of the segments of this anthology. The third segment is the wraparound story itself, featuring Sarah and the children. For me personally, the wraparound is actually the best thing about this film. It has a great Halloween atmosphere. But, more importantly, All Hallows Eve introduced the horror fandom to Art the Clown. He is quickly becoming a modern day horror icon, but not really because of All Hallows Eve. It's mainly because of my bonus pick. You know what it is. Terrifier. Terrifier is a 2017 modern day slasher film that takes place on Halloween night. It's a very basic premise. A sadistic clown stalks and kills people on Halloween night. After first seeing Art the Clown at a pizza place, two girls find themselves stranded when their car won't start. One of the girls calls her sister for a ride. And while they are waiting for her to arrive, Art the Clown's killing spree begins. And that's pretty much it as far as the storyline goes. But what more do you need? It's a slasher film. And not only is it a slasher film, but it really gives off a true 80s slasher vibe. And you know I love that. Terrifier, like All Hallows' Eve that preceded it, has a great Halloween atmosphere. It's also interesting that my two favorite horror subgenres are slashers and anthologies. And well, All Hallows' Eve is the anthology, and Terrifier is the slasher. The fact that they both take place on Halloween is a huge bonus, which is why All Hallows' Eve and Terrifier are my Hollow Watch Day 24 movie picks. And now to lighten up the mood a bit, but still sticking with Halloween of course, my Hollow Watch Day 24 TV pick is Modern Family. Modern Family is probably my favorite modern day sitcom, and it features some great Halloween episodes. The first one, and my favorite of the bunch, is simply titled Halloween, and it came in the second season. This one features the family putting together their own Halloween walkthrough for trick-or-treaters on Halloween night. Of course, things don't originally go as planned, as everybody has their own problems. For example, Phil and Claire's next-door neighbors recently got a divorce, and according to the husband, the wife had just left him, unexpectedly. No signs whatsoever. This, in result, worries Phil, and he stumbles around trying to prove to Claire how much he loves her. If you watch Modern Family, then you probably know that this is actually a humorous scenario regarding Phil, because Ty Beryl is absolutely hilarious as that character. Another one of my favorite Halloween episodes in Modern Family comes in Season 4. This one is titled Open House of Horrors, and the main storyline again focuses around Phil and Claire. Phil is working on Halloween, hosting an open house, and Claire is hiding in the house, trying to scare him. At first, Phil has no idea that Claire is even there, and her plan seems to be failing. But soon enough, scary things begin happening and Phil finds himself in a hilarious situation. Now, there are also other Halloween episodes of Modern Family, including a brand new one that just aired tonight. But for now, you get the point. Modern Family, my Hollow Watch Day 24 TV pick. So there you have it guys, my Hollow Watch Day 24 picks. All Hallows Eve, Terrifier, and Modern Family. One week away from Halloween. And now I leave you with a list of some of my friends also participating in this 31 day challenge. Thanks for watching.